an all-female cohort gives us more opportunities to work without this alpha male dynamics in the group. We've been able to share our experiences more freely and uh, in a safe space, which has all allowed us to probably grow more in as entrepreneurs. It's so refreshing to hear people's journeys of like how they got to where they're at now. We were able to come together and be open and honest. I felt really empowered and got a lot more confidence to ask new questions and explore new ideas. I've met a lot of uh, amazing female founders. We bonded and even identified possible partnerships. My biggest takeaway from the beginning of the course was that if something doesn't exist, create it. We took away some really useful tools in terms of how to cope with, with challenging situations as a founder of which there are plenty. I was able to really understand what it takes to finance a startup and prepare for investment. I learned that it's okay to say no if a big money proposition isn't right for our business needs or ethics. It's important to be open-minded and to be adaptable and validating your assumption is really critical. I learned resilience um, is a journey. It really comes from adversity and struggle. Failure is welcomed and it's generally just very much part of the process. Using storytelling is a powerful way to inspire trust and deliver positive action. I think that what we forget is how inspirational our stories are and how special they are to the business that we run. Climate change is here already and it is getting worse and will continue to get worse until we reverse the trend of growing emissions. Organisations need to be mindful of their impact and dependency on nature because nature underpins everything that we do. What we need is more courageous leaders, those who are here for something bigger than themselves.